Let's join the chef as he prepares turbo au champagne, turbot in champagne. The ingredients are freshly ground pepper, chanterelle mushrooms, onions, some chopped leeks, salt, fish stock, butter, some cream, and a bottle of champagne. The mushrooms are chopped and the onions. A little butter is placed in a pan to melt. When it's melted, the chopped onions are added and the mushrooms. They're stirred as they fry. The champagne is then added and a little more when the froth has died down. The fish stock follows and then the fresh cream. The mixture is seasoned with a little salt and a pinch of freshly ground pepper. The pan is agitated to mix the ingredients which are then poured into a sieve. The solid ingredients are pushed into the sieve to ensure that all the sauce is extracted. Now the fish is prepared. A medium-sized turbot is ideal. Two leeks are sliced lengthways and then chopped finely. A turbot fillet is laid on a flat surface and the skin is removed with a sharp knife and then trimmed for presentation. Now it's cut into three pieces of equal size. Meanwhile, the chopped leeks are added to a saucepan of boiling water. The fillets of turbot are placed in a frying pan to cook on a little oil and seasoned with a little freshly ground pepper. The cooked leeks are removed from the saucepan and placed in a bowl of iced water to cool. The fish fillets are turned to brown on the other side. More pepper is added. And now some butter to add flavor. The fillets are left to fry for a moment longer. Now the cooled leeks are added to some butter in a frying pan. They're shaken a little, a pinch of salt is added, and another twist of pepper. When fried and nicely softened, the leeks are spooned out onto a plate. The turbot fillets are removed from the frying pan, shaken to remove any excess oil, and placed on the plate with the leeks. Finally, the sauce is spooned over the fish in a decorative manner. And it's garnished with two crayfish. Turbo au champagne. Bon appétit.